What is going on? If you are new to my channel, welcome to the party. If you are old to the channel, uh, you pretty much know what I do. I film a lot of videos of uh, Assateak Island, Ocean City, uh, and things around Ocean City, what we do here for fun. So one of the video series that I've been doing is a lot of Assateak Island and mainly the history of it. And um, just a real quick rundown of it. There's a bridge right over there. That's the Verrazano Bridge. That bridge is now the way to get on to Assateak Island. Where I'm standing right here is a South Point boat ramp. Now this used to be the old ferry dock and it would run all the way straight across there. This is all Assateak Island right here and it would run a ferry over right across where it would take cars and people over there uh, prior to the bridge being built. The bridge was built in the 60s. Uh, that's a whole other story. If you watch all my other Aztec videos, uh, you'll learn more about the bridge and why it was put in and all that stuff. But uh, in the meantime, so yes, this is the South Point boat launch and the, there were two ferries that would take people over. One ferry held uh, three cars and the other one held five. And there was also, I don't know, can't uh, remember uh, which side it was on but it was either this side or where this new house is over here but there used to be a little uh, shack with a uh, used to sell like crackers and sodas and stuff like that for uh, the people that were taking the ferry across uh, so this video today is more of the Bunting's Lodge and the inside of the Bunting's Lodge, uh, which a lot of people have not seen. Uh, not its current condition, I'm talking about like when it was used. So the Bunting's Lodge, the lodge was mainly, it was it was for uh, duck hunting. Uh, the Assateague Island is very well known for duck hunting. So it was a lodge that was built for duck hunting. Uh, it was a family lodge. The Bunting family, a lot of them came from Selbyville, Delaware, which is like right across the Maryland line. So the lodge was built for the family, but the family also owned a uh, landscape nursery. And so they would take uh, people from the nursery, VIP customers and stuff, and bring them to the lodge to hunt. They were also local politicians, and so they would hunt with other politicians. And so it was more of like a, a family place to go. And so anyway, so I've been talking with Debbie Bunting. She grew up going to the lodge uh, with her dad and her uncle was one of the ones that owned it. Um, and she has been sharing pictures of, with me of the inside of the lodge and it's absolutely incredible. Now, if you wanna see the other part of this video, go to the previous Bunting's video that I did and you'll see the outside of it and stories that Debbie's told me about the lodge and um, brief history of it, renovation stuff. Uh, very, very interesting stuff. But anyway, I wanted to start it off here at South Point because they would take the ferry over to the island. And basically how they built it, I believe, which a lot of them did. I don't know if Debbie's family did, but they would use the ferries to shuttle supplies across. And then Debbie was saying that uh, eventually they had a car uh, parked over there at the ferry landing on the other side. And she would take, they would get in their boat, drive it over there, get in their car and then drive out to the lodge. So anyway, so I have some very old footage of the lodge that a uh, long, long time ago that I had taken. So I've got pictures from what Debbie has shared with me mixed with my, uh, my footage that I took of inside the lodge. We're gonna go through the lodge and I'll show you what it looks like now and uh, what it looks like before. <laughs> 